Welcome to this channel. In this video, I will show you exactly how to reinstate a hacked WhatsApp account or how to uh, be able to reinstate your WhatsApp account if you have forgotten this two-step uh, uh, verification code. Or maybe you have used an email address uh, for the two-step verification, but you no longer have it and you also forgot the PIN and you cannot set the two-step verification. I will show you how to exactly get your WhatsApp account back if you are facing this problem. So first of all, if you see, for example, something like this, you are trying to register and this is what you saw. So for those not see how it initially began, let me just show you. So you see something like this. you want to register your WhatsApp and then it may, the, the, the interface may differ whether it's iPhone or Android. So it is almost the same, but maybe a slightly different. So you are um, asked to register your number. So you put a number there, then um, you get to this interface, okay? So it says this account is protected by two-step verification. Enter the PIN you created when you set up two-step verification. Your PIN is different from your SMS registration code. So if you have forgotten the PIN or a hacker hacked it and put his email address, um said he a hacker hacked it uh put his uh, set the two factor authentication and put his email address for that two factor authentication reset so now you can reset it you don't also know the pin okay so don't worry if this is your situation i will help you get it resolved so you click on forgot pin click on forgot pin if you click on forgot pin it will bring you to this interface where it will tell you that Reset your PIN via email if you added an email address while setting up your two-step verification. Alternatively, you can reset your WhatsApp account for conti to continue without a PIN. So when you click on send, okay, it is just going to send an email to your um, email, uh, what do you call it? it? It will send a message, the code, the reset code to your email so that you can follow that code to reset. That is if you actually used your email and you still have access to that email and forgot the code. However, if you don't have access to that email, what you have to do is you have to click on reset account. So I'll show you the reset account. There's also another option, contact support, but let me show you the reset account before we come back to the contact support. When you click on reset account option, it will bring you to this particular screen where it says, if you reset your WhatsApp account, you can finish registering without your PIN but your pending messages will be deleted. So what this means is that when you reset your WhatsApp account, it is going to, when you click on the reset like this, if you see this and you actually reset it, it is going to register without the pin. So you'll be able to log into your WhatsApp and register it on that device again. However, those messages you have received that you haven't opened them yet, you will lose all of them, but it will restore your old messages. So check here. If you click on the reset, it is going to restore. So you will see it loading. It will load till finally, um, when it loads and everything is 100%, it will open back to your WhatsApp and you see that your WhatsApp is back again and you can use it, okay? So this is exactly what you need to do, okay? Now, let me show you. If you use that option and it doesn't work, come and click on the contact support option. When you click on contact support, it is going to send you to this particular place where you will be asked to describe your problem. And submit so now this one you will have to say that oh hi what's up uh my whatsapp account has been hacked by uh, a hacker or a froster and after my account was hacked the hacker set a two-factor authentication uh pin on it and use his or her email as the reset email the, the password reset email so now when I try to log in, I'm asked to put the, uh, the two-factor authentication code, which I don't have. It is also asking me to reset the pin by sending to the WhatsApp number. And unfortunately, I don't have access uh, by sending to the email, sorry, by sending to the email. Unfortunately, I don't have access to the email that the hacker has placed on it. So I can't get into my WhatsApp. Please help me um, reset my WhatsApp uh, and remove the two-factor authentication code and help me log in back to my WhatsApp. So when you say that, add a screenshot of the part where you are told that you should put a two-step verification pin. After that, you submit it. 
when you submit it, when you click on it, it will direct you to your email to submit it. Now, after you submit it, normally what will happen is that you will be, um, it, it will direct, in fact, when you click on submit, it will direct you, it will redirect you to your email and you submit through your email. So you'll get a response uh, to your email mostly within 40, in fact, sometimes it is instant. It will even take up to 30 minutes. You will receive the email within five to 30 minutes. But in some cases, it may take longer, maybe up to 24 hours or six hours. It can take up to six hours or 24 hours for it to open again. They normally will review your account and see what exactly happened. So if you follow this procedure, you will be able to log in to your WhatsApp um, account again and reset your two-step verification pin and, and access your WhatsApp. Thank you so much for watching. Please, I know by now you have watched up to this far, but you haven't subscribed yet. It just hit the subscription uh, button, subscribe to this channel, turn on the notification bell, like this video, and then uh, for other more powerful videos we will be publishing. We, we, we do a lot of videos and to help you to be able to solve the issues that you may be facing. Also leave your comments in the comment section. You can follow the WhatsApp link in the description to WhatsApp us if you still have a problem after watching this video so that we can help you get your issue resolved. Thank you once again for watching and see you in the next video. Bye-bye.